Let's go. Hot like fire. Giving the people what they need. What they need. My oh my. Hey, bring that flame, that gasoline. Hey, can't deny. This young boy, he bring that heat. Hey, my oh my. Bring that flame, that gasoline. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm your girl Nini, and today, you guys. We're about to have fun. We're about to go on a quick little road trip to go get fireworks for 4th of July. And I am so freaking excited. My skin is dry. Look. Mm, mm, mm. So I'm going to use castor oil and Nivea. You guys know that's my combination. I'm not putting any makeup on because we're just going to be sitting in a car picking up fireworks. We're not, that I know of, we're not doing anything else special. So, mm. No makeup today. It's too hot for makeup. It's too hot for makeup. <laughs> so, yeah, you guys, I'm so excited. Um, this time last year, we went for the first time. It's like the next city over. It's like 45 minutes away. Um, I took Babe for Father's Day over there to get part of fireworks for 4th of July. And I had a $200 budget. And we did pretty decent with that $200 budget, but it just made us want to do it bigger and better this year. So we're doing it bigger and better this year. I invited my family. So my dad and his wife are coming up, my sister and her husband, and her babies are coming up. And I'm super excited about it. <laughs> so um, everybody pitched in. Everybody pitched in. There's going to be food. There's going to be firecrackers. We're going to go, you know, get in the pool. You know, just live that nice little Las Vegas summer luxury 4th of July day. But today is just the firecrackers. Um, we're taking the boys. We didn't take the boys last year because, like I said, it was a Father's Day, like, gift. So, no offense to kids. But, you know, on those days, we want to break. <laughs> Anywho. So the boys are ready. As you can see, I'm getting moisturized and together. All I have to do is finish getting moisturized. Put on my shoes, really. Then that way he can come in. I think he said he was stopping at uh, AutoZone to get coolant <laughs> for the car. Um, you know, that way we don't have no problems because the heat ain't playing this year. So he's gonna do that. Um, I got some snacks for the kids. You know, it ain't a road trip without snacks. So just a little bit of snacks because like really seriously, we'll be there and back in a minute, but it's still fun to do a road trip, you know what I'm saying? To get out of the city and, you know, see things and take the kids and turn on the music and, you know, all that kind of stuff. So I really am excited because I can't wait to see what we get this year. There is going to be a pile. It's going to be a pile. Nate made a budget. I made a budget. And my family pitched in. Oh, my gosh. We're going to light up the sky. And it's so fun because, like, how do I say it? Like, it's not competition, really. It's just you want to be the latest house on the block. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? So I'm excited about that. That's what we're going to do. So I'm going to finish putting on this concoction of mine real quick. Put on my shoes. That way when he gets here, I'm ready and I can be out of his way. And he can get ready and we can go. Because I don't know why, but men, all they got to do is take a shower, brush their teeth, comb their hair, they done. It's not fair. I swear it's not fair. <laughs> but anyways, let me show you guys the snacks I got for the kids. It ain't nothing really, but I'm going to show you guys. Um, I got my first birthday gift in the mail today. I'm excited. My birthday's coming. That's why I, I am excited about the month of July. Um, Fourth of July kind of kicks off the month, lets you know it's July. You know, it starts getting blazing hot. You start spending a whole bunch of time in the pool. The barbecue grill stays on, you know, like birthday month. So 
I'm excited. I get to spend it with my family. I get to spend it with you guys because there will be. I'm going to do a part two because y'all know how storage goes. So um, this will be part one and then 4th of July day will be part two. Okay, so stay tuned. Um, but yeah, let me, let me get out my husband's way. He's not here yet, but you know, let me finish doing what I'm doing. Get out of his way and show you guys the snacks. And then we should be on our way. Okay, you guys, so we finally made it into the car. Everybody's excited. You guys excited? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep. It's a little warm out here already, but we're excited and we're ready to go. Hit the thumbs up button. Yes, like this video. <laughs> Let's go, y'all. <laughs> Yes. Okay, you guys. So we have made it into the city that sells the firecrackers. But come on, y'all. But Babe is hungry. He went to a work today and got off. You know how you do overtime on Saturdays? You just do a couple hours. So he's starving. It's lunchtime for him. So we've decided to stop at McDonald's. Make the kids here. They stop at McDonald's. Um, so let's go eat. I'll probably just get some chicken nuggets. I don't know what I'm gonna get. But yeah, let's go eat. Yeah. 
So you have to go to the menu thing and order yourself a drink. What do you need, babies? Mom, I have a great idea. This is your mom, okay? Okay, mom. I have a great idea. You know what? So when I'm not hungry, I'm not going to eat, but when I'm hungry, I'm going to turn my ear and eat, right? That's a great idea. We're not hungry right now. We're not hungry right now. He had um, everything, you know, he had two drinks and um, what was the other one for? Ooh, I almost spilled my sauce. Mm -hmm. A couple. Okay, you guys, so as you saw, we had lunch. I wouldn't say delicious, but it was McDonald's. It was edible. We're full. Low-key caught the itis. Excuse me. So now, we're about to go get the fireworks. Yay! You guys excited? Woo! Let's go. Everybody, share. Good. 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 A lot of people look at their cart. Look at that cart. That's what we want. Yeah, I know you were gonna stop up and go. Oh shit. They didn't go in front of me, you dickhead. Oh, dude. Yeah, that's why I got that pack, you know, because it has everything that you little kids would want to play with. You guys saw everything we got that money went by so fast but it was fun as you guys saw it was crowded it was low-key kind of warm in there but it's an experience it's a fun experience to have with the kids you know to pick out firecrackers so 
Um, they did a little bit of damage, but the kids have fun. Babe is putting everything in the car now. So I will see you guys on 4th of July. Okay, see you later. Bye. Okay, you guys. So, excuse me laying down, but I'm laying down because it's hot. It's 106 outside. Even though we had the air conditioner on, you can still feel the heat coming through the windows. <laughs> it's crazy hot. And then, you know, we just brought everything in the house. And I have to rest real quick because I still have balls that I need to roll today for tomorrow. Tomorrow's Sunday. Today's Saturday, June 29th. It's about two o'clock in the afternoon so i'm just taking a quick like rest i'll get back up around 3 34 and start rolling the balls for tomorrow anywho so i just wanted to come back on real quick and you know talk about our experience which was really fun again like i said we obviously had more money this time than last time to spend on firecrackers and we have more family members coming so you know the bigger the better with everything that you do so that was fun but I want to make sure that next time we go, like, at the beginning of June, if possible. And in the middle of the week, first thing in the morning. Not the Saturday before 4th of July when everybody's off. That's what everybody's doing. It seemed like the whole city was in that one store. And they have several, like, um, warehouse stores on that block well, that's not the only one but it is the first one that you see driving up this strip of firework house uh, warehouses so obviously it's the most popular and it was fun you know there's a there's a rush it's exciting everybody's you know having fun you know but it, you don't really get the chance to look you kind of I don't know you kind of just grab and go I am the type of person where I rather compare prices and you know this one gets this many and this one gets that many and this one's on sale let's get two of these compared to the one price of this one you know like I'm one of those um, I believe that if we if there was less people because the whole time you're worried about moving out of people's ways other people moving out of your way you know um you're more focused on that than being able to really pay attention to what you're purchasing and stuff so to wipe off the phone or the camera yeah that looks so much better okay so you know what i'm saying you're more worried about you know jojo come stand here you know stay right there you, you, you know so we're de i'm definitely you know you learn something every every time you do something that was this was our second time going so third time's a charm so now we know to go sooner in the month not on the last saturday before fourth of july and to go in the middle of the week you know when they open and it should be so much calmer and we should be able to get more for our buck I really feel like we could have got more for our buck again if I had time to really you know shop like a woman then everybody and this is a squished warehouse they need to expand their warehouse they need a big they need a huger space and they need air conditioning <laughs> that's another thing i don't know if las vegas has us spoiled or what but we're you know air conditioning is everywhere and they had no air conditioning so you got all this body heat and like literally seriously you just want to kind of like get in add up your tally and get out and i don't like to do that i like to shop and bargain and look at prices and compare and do that so anyways lesson learned i'm not complaining i'm just saying that i learned a lesson I learn a lesson in almost everything that I do. And we did great though. We're gonna have a ball. I can't wait for my family to come up. I already took a picture and showed them. They're all excited. They're like, dang. So we're gonna have a ball. The kids are gonna love it. And we're gonna do what we do. So um, 
I'm going to close out the blog and I will see you guys in the next one. And again, the next one will be actual 4th of July, 4th of July. All right. So everyone take care and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Mm-hmm.